All right, welcome back to Mega Man X, all you lads and lasses out there. Uh, so, we beat the Chill Penguin, and now uh, I think I'm going to go fight Spark Mandrill. You know, I, I didn't remember who was weak to what in the last video, but uh, I, I recall something, a little something called Spark Mandrill Syndrome, and I think I'm a freezing thing, so I was like, I think Spark Mandrill's next. Uh, and forgive me if I don't, like, find any, like, if there's a capsule in here, I do not know about it. I'll, I'll come back and get it if I have to. I, because, I, like, I just, I didn't look any, <laughs> up where any of that shit is or anything. I just kind of went right back to it. Oh, damn it. By the way, do not take that ladder down. That ladder down leads to solid, stinky, horny death. Like, it's nothing but death down there. There's no, there's no nothing. It's just, an, it's ass. Capcom being a bunch of douches. Oh shit. Oh shit. There we go. I'm sorry if I sound a little groggy. I, I was just at the gym a minute ago and uh, I am fucking worked. You know, because I was working out. Just so it makes sense. But now I, I put in a little a little too much work maybe. Use a little too much of that uh, that good old Kaoken there. You know what I mean? And, uh, you know, weird thing, actually. Very, very strange thing that happened afterwards. I, I went to the gas station. I was like, man, you know, I gotta put some gas in the car and shit. I got school tomorrow and all that jazz. And, uh, I went in there and I bought a, uh, a decaffeinated tea. The Marley's Mellow Mood. I mean, it's endorsed by Bob Marley. How can you hate it, right? Um, but it, it's weird. I, I got the peach raspberry tea. And I was like, okay, this sounds fucking awesome. Like, I like peaches. I like raspberry. I like peach raspberry tea. That's, oh, God, this thing. Oh, this thing sucks. He shoots these little gooey jizz balls out. And then, like, if you step in him like that, then that happens. And he fucking, he hurts you so much. Like, he hits you so hard. And, of course, you know, I don't have, like, a sub tank right now or anything. No, 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 no. no. I think I went into, like, Friday the 13th mode there for a second. Um, <laughs> but, uh, yeah, so I go in there. I get the Marley's Mellow Mood. I get the Peach Raspberry Tea. And it just, like... It tastes like straight up fucking passion fruit. It says it's got a hint of passion fruit to it. I was like, dude, no fucking way, hint of pa ah, damn it. I was like, no way, man. This thing just straight tastes like fucking passion fruit. So, I also tried the uh, it's a, it's a honey green tea, and I normally hate green tea. I mean, fucking hate it. It's so gross to me. And <laughs> for some reason, it ends up being I like the honey green tea that they have, and I dislike the. As weird as that is, <laughs> the only other, t it, actually, the only other green tea I like, Panera Bread. They have amazing green tea, because it just doesn't, I mean, don't get me wrong, if you're like a tea purist, you're probably not going to like it, because like, the reason I like it is because it doesn't taste like green tea at all, it tastes like fucking kiwi juice. <laughs> like, I swear to God, it just tastes like straight up kiwi somehow. Ah, stupid electricity. Okay, okay, moving on. Yeah, they're shooting little crescent moons at me. It's pretty weird. I'd actually like to get a look at that thing, see what the fuck it is. Like, is it a little guy riding a moon or something? I'm not sure. No, okay, it's like a little... Ah, it's like a little fish bot with a moon fin. Either way, I don't like him. Nor do I like these little ostrich bastards. And I keep getting hit by that, and that is not good. That is not bode well for our fucking situation that I'm about to have here. It's messed up because, like, the mini-boss seems to be actually harder than the real boss of the stage. You know. Spark Mandrill Syndrome. What the hell?! Come on. What was that about? Eee! Alright, alright. Lemons, 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 lemons! Ah, oh, I'm gonna get you all these- Oh, no, 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 oh, no! Oh, no! Kool-Aid Man says, oh, no! Oh, shit. Whoa, fuck. All right, all right. Come on, lemons, lemons, lemons. No, no, lemons, lemons, melons, no. Yes. Oh, fuck yeah. And he's got like a little depressed look. Look at him. He's got like a little, oh, oh, he's got like a little frown. <laughs> that was pretty cool. All right, I think they might, they might be uh, launching more moons at me. Oh yeah, these guys. Wow. He's spazzing the fuck out. He's just like, don't hit me. I don't like it. All right. There we go. Let's see if we can yield some health out here. Oh, yeah, that's that's going to work. That's going to work real well for me. 
Oh god. Okay. There we go. There we go. Yeah. There we go. Alright. Fuck. Son of a bitch! Okay, okay, okay. Whew. One more time. No health. God damn it. What a bunch of assholes. Like, why are they not giving me any health? Like, why do they gotta be such douches? Why you gotta be so rude, man? Magic. <laughs> you know what? It's actually really weird. There's a weird game that that song like got stuck in my head. I don't know. Like I heard it like a bunch of times, and it's like a weird thing. Like sometimes when you listen to music and play a game at the same time, like certain songs get stuck in your head and you associate it with that game. Like um, as a, for instance, Knights of the Old Republic. Ooh, Heart Tank. Yay. Knights of the Old Republic, the very first one. There's a certain, well, pretty much the whole game, actually. Like, that was the, uh, around the time that the Outcast Speaker Box CD came out. Great group. Great CD. Yeah, CDs. We used to use them before digital downloads, kids. But, um, yeah, and I always, like, there's a few songs in there that I used to hear a lot, like, um, during certain sections of the game and stuff for some reason. Like, uh, when you're doing, like, the Rat Ghoul thing. And I swear to God, like, every time I play that game, even if I'm, if I'm not, like, listening to that... I hear that fucking song in my head, it's like, as part of the game, it's the fuckest thing, and, um, surprisingly enough, Magic, Rude by Magic actually got stuck in my head playing, um, The Last of Us, so, like, every time I play The Last of Us, I hear, why you gotta be so rude, I'm just like, oh god, this is like the most inappropriate song ever to be in this game, okay, what, no more moons. Get out of here with your... Oh, dude, holy shit. I fucking killed the moon and gave me health. I didn't even know I could kill the moons. It's pretty badass. Oh, fuck, but I fucked it that time. Oh, okay. Fuck you, moon. Ha <laughs> ha. <laughs> I'll moon you, you bastard. All right, you know what? It's, it's really hard to, like, hold a charge and fucking jump dash at the same time, so I'm just not going to try that right now. Oh, here we go. Our old buddy Spark Mandrill. Let's go fucking... Let's go have some words with this gentleman. And I'll just go ahead and equip this shotgun ice. We'll see how he likes it. We'll see if he's, uh... Let's see if I was right. If I remembered correctly that he is, a uh, He is freezable. And I believe I heard it from the... Like, I think I was watching, like, a video from the, uh... From, like, the completionist or something. And he was like, Spark Mandrill syndrome. And he was, like, freezing an enemy or something. And I was like, okay, that's what he means. Oh, what the fuck? Come on, man. Yeah, there you go. Oh, damn. I, fuck my, I almost fucked myself a couple of times there, like, but... Nah, we got him. It's all good. So now I'm gonna get, like, some sort of thunder punch fucking rock in the world. Thundery thunder. By the way, um... Just saying. The Mega Man X cartoon. Yeah, there's a Mega Man X cartoon. It was, like, from the 80s or something. Or, I'm um, sorry. It was a Mega Man cartoon. There was an episode in which X was on there. <laughs> And that show is corny as fuck, but it was awesome. X, Vile, and Spark Mandrill was on there. It's, it was really awesome. It was very cool. Like, it's on YouTube, at least, like, the parts with X. And check that shit out. If you're a Mega Man fan, it's pretty cool. Definitely check it out. I don't know who's next. Hmm. Hmm. Let's maybe... Ugh, fuck, I don't know. Maybe the octopus? Because, like... He, he's got like, I got like shock powers now, and he's underwater. That seems like it'd be the jam, right? Hmm. You know what? I don't think it's actually going to matter. Because we're going to do it on the next episode. And maybe I'll look it up. And maybe I'll look up what the fuck the capsules are, because I have no idea anymore. It's been too long since I played this game. So, come back. See you on the next episode. Bring yourselves on back and we gonna fight maybe this octopus or we might go fight that armadillo over there. Love y'all. Good night. Thank you for watching. Oh, by the way, one lamentation real quick. The bears suck this year so far and it's making me very sad because I fucking love football and I love the bears. <laughs> very sad. Good night.